Anyone who has sat in meditation has probably found that at times thoughts run rampant. Whether you're an experienced meditator or fairly new to meditation practice, you probably already know that it is painful to be engaged with an unruly, distracted mind. Distracting thoughts obstruct the deepening of concentration during meditation. And in ordinary life, some mental habits can lead to agitation, anxiety, worry, insomnia, and depression when we start to meditate. We might practice diligently letting go of thoughts, but moments later we watch them arise again. We might struggle with our thoughts, abandoning them dozens of times, but find they persist despite our vigorous efforts. To what extent can you choose to direct your thoughts? And to what extent are you at the mercy of your conditioning? Whether you are motivated to develop deep concentration or you simply want to live with greater inner peace and clarity, it is useful to develop skills for removing distracting thoughts. We can learn to engage our thinking in ways that lead to peace, tranquility, and mental clarity. The Buddha tells us that before his enlightenment, he suffered from thoughts connected with sensual desire, with ill will, and with harming. Yes, even the Buddha had unwholesome thoughts, but he figured out how to deal with them skillfully. And he shares a sequence of practical strategies that can help us also learn to remove them. I built this online course around two discourses that are found in the middle length discourses of the Buddha, suttas number 19 and 20. They inspire a pragmatic series of instructions that support the deepening of concentration and the refining of our mind. I hope that you will decide to join this online course. Registration information is on our website at bodhicourses.org. That's B-O-D-H-I-C-O-U-R-S-E-S dot O-R-G.